They call me Fireman. Yo, what is up, you guys? Hope you're partying like every day is your birthday, because we got another one for you guys today. And we got a little bit more of a sad and serious video for you guys, man. We got videos and sounds every kid from the early 2000s will remember. So, you know what I'm saying? Make sure you bring out some tissues. Get you a little, you know what I'm saying? Something, something. Some popcorn, some ice cream, whatever your comfort food is. Some tissues. And uh, we're going to hop right into this video, because it's going to be sad, bro. But at the same time, y'all, you got to realize how blessed we are, you know? Think about it. Just think about it, bruh. You could have been born 20 years or 1,000 years sometime in the future. Or you could have been born 20 years or 1,000 years in the past, you know? And or even more than that. But instead, you was born right at the time when we had all of the best stuff. The best games, Black Ops 1, Black Ops 2, Prime Fortnite. Well, that was like 2017, so actually, that was that's not really 2000s. But Black Ops 1, Black Ops 2, Black Ops 3? <laughs> Bro, they don't even know. They don't even know. Cartoon Network, you got Regular Show, Adventure Time, Muff, and, and then you got the OG, the Disney Channel shows like... Bro, what is the one? Like, Hello, Charlie? Ooh, bro, if y'all remember Hello, Charlie, you definitely were a 2000 kid, bro. For sure, for sure. But, you know, think about how perfect it was where we were born. We got y'all to experience, I feel like, the best stuff. We was really blessed. We was really blessed with our childhood, bro. So let's get into it, man. And reminiscing it a little bit. Oh, bro, and shout out to Ra Ra for this video, man. What? Bro, where would they put this shit, bro? I remember seeing this all the time. This brought back a memory right here, bruh. I'm trying to think. A movie, bro. It was for the movie theaters on Pretty. Or was it? I can't remember you guys. One of y'all in the comments let me know if this was on TV or in the movies, bro. I don't know why I can't remember, but I definitely remember this video. Piracy is a crime. What the hell is this? The Xbox? I don't even remember that one. That's cr I do not remember it being like that. That one was fluke. See? Y'all, this is what I'm talking about when I say we were born at the perfect time. This intro's 10 times better than the one they got. Now for Xbox One. See, it's because everything I feel like has been solidified, y'all. Like iPhones, Xbox, all that stuff. They don't got to try anymore. 2K. And you know why they don't got to try? Because we are so, like, stuck into... Oh, this is the game, or this is the phone, or this is the console, that we buy it every time. And it doesn't matter what they put out, bro. Literally does not matter what they put out. That you and that they won't be able to make enough money where it's good. Why work on something if you can do it for free? You know what I mean? Oh, let's just copy and paste this game and add change one or two things, but I'll cost like 20 bucks and the rest we make revenue. They gonna buy it anyway. I feel like no one just be trying anymore. Look at this intro. This shit was so much better, bro. Now we just got some lame ass shit. I don't even know what it is, but it's lame. Look at the Sony one, man. The PlayStation 2. That's a top tier console, bro. That was a top tier console, the PlayStation 2. Same with the Wii. Wii Sports. Baseball, boxing, and tennis, bro. I'm smoking anyone in. And bowling. Perfect score on bowling. I knew the glitch to the bowling. Oh, yeah. The tennis, bruh. 
You could release it at a certain point. And I remember you could get a fastball. That shit was broken. Bad serve. Bro, I used to get... When people would do shit like that, I would get so mad at this game. Like, when you would sling it into the corners and it was unhittable, that shit would make me so pressed, bro. When I'd be playing my fam or something, that used to make me so pressed. Oh my god, nah! Nah! Boomerang did have some fire intros, but I forgot about the boomerang intros. I forgot even about this at all. Bro, they used to have such good intros to the show with these characters and shit. I forgot about this. I really forgot about this one. Ever be in this long, yeah. This used to be in everything. This isn't the Warner Brothers intro anymore. Why are we changing this shit? But that was fire. Damn, now this one, sadly, I can't say I experienced, bro. My parents would not let me get this game, y'all, until, like, a few, like, years ago, bro, or something like that. You know what I'm saying? They always, like, oh, I don't want you getting the game. You ain't gonna be beating no strippers and, you know what I'm saying, going to the strip club in my house. So, yeah, I was never able to be able to get that shit, bro. So, that's very tough. That's very tough. Damn, man. This might be the greatest intro to a game ever, though. I'm not gonna lie. It has to be. That music, bro. God. Uh. That shit is tough, bro. This shit definitely made me want to go rob a bank or something like that. Damn, that's all we got? Damn, bro, I really want to watch that. I'm going to hold off and not watch that one, actually, bro. So if you guys want to see that one, let me know down in the comments, man. But uh, what an awesome, awesome video, bro. For real, though, shout out to Ra Ra. This dude is low-key that dude because I've seen a lot of, like, shit on TikTok. And we've seen, I think, one or two of these before. And I have never ever seen one with this in the boomerang one like that man is definitely a 2000 kid at heart that's crazy he remember that shit bro damn that is just crazy man we really were lucky kids bro i just really hope we ain't living our prime past or our, our past is not the prime you know what i mean it's just supposed to be getting better man that's tough but still, great video. Hope to see you on the horror stream tonight. Little nightmares. Be there. Be square, man. But y'all be easy. And deuces.